so guys, I made it first cloud. It was quite interesting because I got on the stage and I see a judge, Steve, and I know him, he's from Beth Francis, a really cool guy, and I don't know why, but it's like kind of got me, I was like, oh, I don't know why, like, I don't know why I felt that. So my coach said that my posing was kind of a little bit stiff. I saw the video, my friends sent me the video, I think it was good, but just um, the matter of couple poses that's probably like because I've, I've, I've been hesitating um, about front pose because I didn't have a coach so to watch me meaning like a posing coach so I guess I need just to, to change that but hey nationals first call out I'm happy. You can cannot probably see this right now on my face because I'm really tired and I want to go and eat something. I'm not going to eat anything. He's like, go eat burger. I'm like, I don't want. Because I know how my, my stomach will feel. So I don't want to do that. I'm going to just go. I have avocado. Um, I have uh, chicken. And I really want like exactly bread. So I'm probably going to just make myself... Um, you know, a sandwich, and uh, probably gonna take a nap because I'm like dying, adrenaline kind of finished. So right now, it's just um, it's just some rest, but I'm super glad. I'm super glad I'm, I did it. Amazing feeling. I'm back on track. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It's. 6.36 and I'm already up. I woke up at 5.30. Couldn't sleep. Um, since it's super expensive to do uh, makeup twice in this competition, um, I decided to... I violated my own rules. I never sleep with my makeup on. I always take it off, no matter what, no matter how I feel, no matter if I'm like falling asleep right in my bathroom. But uh, sometimes you have to sacrifice that too. So with that being said, sleeping, I don't know how people sleep with makeup on. First of all, this crazy, uh, crazy eyelashes were poking my eyes. And I was like constantly trying to kind of scratch it. And I'm like, oh shit, don't do this, Julia. Um, second of all, I was, of course, sleeping with my hair extensions on which created another kind of uncomfortable feeling for me and I woke up hungry <laughs> so I already got my two my uh, double shot of espresso what it does well I haven't um, well I have yesterday because of espresso too but like peak week and when you especially eating like very dry and it's not fiber enriched uh, food. Uh, going to the bathroom, kind of difficult. So double shot of espresso helps with that, 100%. And then I have my black coffee. Um, I'm lying to you. It's black coffee, it's Americano, but I ask for like a little bit of steamed almond milk because I have gastritis. I had gastritis and uh, I can drink it, but then double shot of espresso, it's kind of gonna irritate my stomach a lot. So it just a little bit, which is not gonna be a lot. And for my breakfast, I have one English muffin and three ounces of chicken. Yeah, so I'm gonna go to supermarket right now because I need to buy some some food. I didn't bring any red meat or salmon or anything like that. So I wanna buy something or at least something that I can cook it with because I don't have anything. Um, and then I'm gonna go to the hotel because I need to work on my website and I have a, a client 
and probably gonna go to a venue um, maybe even gonna go backstage um, not sure yet so this is it this is uh, the morning uh, of the second day and today is the finals oh my weight is the same as it was yesterday nothing changed it's good and I didn't eat anything bad just uh, as I killed bread and chicken and some avocado because I'm not a, an enemy to my body my body didn't have anything super greasy like burger or anything like that and you know you're gonna treat your body as if it was your pet like a dog or kin and would you feed your dog with shit like that after like let's say dog I don't know just got back from uh, hospital or from the doctor because he had like a stomach ache or whatever even if it even if he didn't have anything would you treat your dog dog like that would you give him that amount of food no so don't do this to your body if you're on prep especially and it's already like a big week and you're already in the show and you're waiting for a second day yeah like a burger it's a you know it's a good option but try to ask with like a uh, low fat cheese try to see if they can um, you know just uh, create it with a minimum calorie uh, intake mi minimum calories in it because man you don't have those enzymes in you but you've been dieting for so long you don't have those enzymes and when you get this food inside of you your body goes like uh and and what should I do this? Yeah, it will take certain, some stuff to the glycogen. And of course, it depends on your weight, depends on your sex. Um, and depends on if you are actually depleted. You know, because some people just, they cut on prep and they barely prep. <laughs> you know? And they're like, oh, I depleted, I need to eat a lot of food. No, you don't, you don't have to. Reverse diet, you know, is the best way. So anyway, you're getting those calories in one shot and people just eating crazy amount of calories, 7,000, 8,000, 10,000. Well, this is all energy. How much do you think your body can store, or replenish your glycogen and like your brain uh, abilities because it does kind of like gets a little bit twiggy because you know, my short term, uh, term memory yesterday was like, non-existent because I I took my uh, key from the hotel I put it somewhere and I forgot just literally like a second ago and it happened like 5,000 times anyway so going back to eating uh, that many calories so it will take certain things of course to replenish your energy and then do you think what's gonna go to what the best and easiest way is to like okay this is this I'm gonna put this here, I'm gonna put this here, like muscle glycogen, uh, liver glycogen, you know, blah blah blah, some tissues, and I'm like, hmm. and the rest just, let's just convert it to fat, you know, uh, maybe poop some of it, yeah, so this is how people rebound, like 20 pounds within a week, it's crazy, can you imagine you feed your dog so it can gain 20 pounds within a week it will die like your heart will stop beating so don't treat your body like that doesn't i know that it's hard especially after competition like you you it's that limit or you know the boundaries that you had they kind of like non-existent anymore and you're like oh i can eat but hold on to that food is not a treat right it's like you're not you're not gonna die if you eat actually less but slowly increase it but in the long run you will end it up eating more than you just gain all the weight back and fucked up your entire prep for what for just once stepping on a stage and then getting back as like a as you would never actually compete in in your life I, I don't see a point I think we we should take better care about our um, of our bodies and our health. So, with that being said, 
I'm gonna go and get some healthy food. So I'm back to life. <laughs> I got back to my hotel after shopping and um, I took a nap and it helped. So guys, usually if you feel like you're really, um, you know, exhausted and tired, you just need more, more sleep because your brain doesn't know. Um, he can feel, you can feel like you're hungry, but because you already felt so exhausted and low on energy when you were hungry, your brain can mistake it with like, just want to sleep. And with that being said, I already got my second meal, three and a half ounces of lean bread meat. I bought the lemon Oh my God. Amazing. And I have 30 grams of granola that I made myself. And I want to show you one thing, it's so, so hilarious. Oh, this is a small, uh, cute little frying pan. Uh, it's a car, uh, iron cast. And this is another steak that I'm making in case I need it. And this is how it goes. This is what competition life looks like. Um, we were just so exhausted. And as you can see, everything is like all over the place. <laughs> By the way. Tip number, I don't know, another tip, bring your sheets, because when you have your tent on, the hotel may charge you for doing this. <laughs> 